Mike, doesn't utilizing the Epic Genoa powered instances for performance come with some type of cost associated with it? So, you know, that's an interesting question. Uh, when I first brought the seventh generation, the Genoa powered instances to market and we took them out to our customers, one of the first things they said, one of the first things that I heard is, wow, that sounds really great. I love it. But I look at the cost and it seems to be the retail cost, the hourly cost is kind of a lot. And they think, oh, well, I can't afford it. But that's actually an incorrect conclusion uh, for performance and time bound workloads. What you really need to look at is the net job cost, not just the hourly cost, but the job costs. So for instance, with Redis databases, if you compare uh, a workload that's running on x86 versus the alternatives, the Epic Genoa instances have about 2.2 times the performance of the alternative Intel instance. Because it runs so fast, it means the job runs in half the time. And so at 2.2x the performance, the net job cost is roughly 50% of the equivalent Intel instance.